G'day everyone and welcome back to Planter Banter. I have a pretty cool video today. We're going to be looking at the Woolamai Pine. If you don't know too much about this tree species, then stick around to the end because I'll be talking about it a little bit more. It's an absolutely remarkable story and I'll show you the footage I've taken of all the local ones I've seen. But right now, we're going to be looking at these cuttings that my good mate Dan was able to get for me and we're going to be turning them into little baby trees. For the mixture, I'm using a 50-50 between perlite and peat moss. This will allow for really good aeration and allow for free movement of the newly formed roots. It's also free draining, but will also retain enough water uh, for the plant itself. Make sure you wet your substrate before putting your cuttings in because any hormone gel will wash away if you do it afterwards. Now I know a lot of people struggle to strike cuttings, so I'm going to give you three tips and if you follow them, your success rate will be significantly higher. Tip one, if you can't put your cuttings into something straight away, keep them wet. So put them in a plastic container filled with water or spray them and put them in a plastic bag. Step two is don't use regular potting mix for your cuttings guys. Unless it's one of those extremely easy species to propagate, you'll do much better with perlite. And the absolute most important tip is you must mist your cuttings very regularly and keep them at 100% humidity. If they dry out, they will die. I'm also putting mine on a heat mat as you can see here and under some grow lights. It's also next to a really big window with indirect light. And here's some of my will my pine. And obviously this is not from the batch I just did but you can expect something like this from one to two years. So I have now got some footage to show you of some Willamai pine that are local in my area in Adelaide, South Australia. These trees are some of the oldest and rarest trees in the entire world. They have fossils dating back to when dinosaurs existed a long, long time ago. And for decades and decades, we believed that they were extinct. But in 1994, a fellow by the name of David Noble was abseiling in the Blue Mountains, 120 kilometers northwest of Sydney, which is in Australia. And he came across this gully filled with these trees that he had never seen before. And there was less than 100 mature trees in this group. And it turned out to be Willamai pine. He took some samples back and they rediscovered this species or discovered it for the first time, really. And they'd only ever seen it in fossils, like I said before. So it's basically like discovering a dinosaur or something. It's absolutely incredible. So this site is actually completely secret. There's only a handful of people that have ever been there. And what they've done is they've done some testing and they've done some trials and they've propagated it. And then after some time, they sent it all around the world to preserve this wonderful tree that they've just found. So now in 2021, those people that are responsible for the preservation of this species is encouraging more and more people to actually get this tree, if you can, if it will grow where you are, and to plant it because you can be involved in keeping this species alive. So in these videos, these trees are no older than 30 or so years. Some of them are much younger than that, obviously. But in the wild, 
they can get up to 40 meters high and we don't know how long they can live for but they assume that they can live for hundreds and hundreds of years which is so amazing and now they're trying to protect this species with everything that they've got and reintroduce new populations into the wild how cool is that if you made it this far thank you very much for tuning in i hope you found this video fun and informative and please like share and subscribe say good day in the comments and yeah thank you very much i'll see you next time everyone bye